Good morning. Hello. I'm driving to work right now and I just wanted to start the vlog. I'm really trying to vlog more so that there's two to three vlogs a week instead of just one. So yeah, I just remembered to vlog right now so that's why I'm doing it from this weird angle in my car. But I'm gonna go now because this is considered distracted driving, I think, so. Bye. Hello, people. I just finished work and I'm running over to Tim's to get myself a little snack and take one to my mom before I leave for the day. So I'm just waiting in the drive through now and the lineup is really, really long. Uh, other than that, I don't really have any plans today. I might try and do some homework. Um, yeah, school starts this week. I obviously, my last vlog was me cleaning, getting ready for school. But um, yeah, it officially started today. I just don't have any classes Tuesday or Wednesdays. Um, I have classes Monday, Thursday, and Friday. So, I might try and work on some stuff for this week and next week, but we will see. Hi, can I please get a sesame seed bagel double toasted with two packs of peanut butter on it? And I'll get a four cheese bagel toasted with plain cream cheese. And a small ice cap, please. Small ice coffee? Ice cap. I'm sorry, my finishing is down. Oh, okay. Then just just the bagels then. Oh. It's probably better for me anyways to not have a nice cap. Everything happens for a reason, right? Sorry. That's okay. Can I pay for the person behind me too? Thank you. You too. Always pay it forward, y'all. Every once in a while, it doesn't hurt to be a nice person. This is for couples only. Who's the most fun in the relationship? Who makes the food in the relationship? Who's the most talented? Who's the most adventurous in the relationship? Who spends the most money in the relationship? Who's the best kisser? Who smells the best? Who loves the most? Who gives the best massages in the relationship? Last question, who will be the first to die in the relationship? Good morning. Today's Wednesday and I'm on my way to work right now. My last day of work before school starts and then who knows if I'll be working at all. We'll see. Let's do this. Hello! It is such a beautiful day and it's even better because my Shein package finally came. So let's do a haul. Here they all are. I have no idea really at all remember what I got. Um, and I've never ordered from Shein before so I'm a little bit worried about the quality because everything's really cheap but 
hopefully it's good and I'll do like a review and a try on and whatever. But let's just get into it. First we have, what is this? A black t-shirt with a little heart on the pocket. Then I got, I'm really excited for this, this white v-neck um, spaghetti strap little top. This is perfect for summer. I got white tank top crop top with a butterfly on it. It's super cropped, um, but it's okay because I'm gonna work out. <laughs> Next, I got this skirt that everyone has on TikTok. This pink floral skirt. Next, I got this tie-dye kind of pink crop top. This is just nice for when you're wearing jeans or whatever. What is this? Oh, I got this white. I'm really into those tops right now that are just like a um what are those things called i don't know but the ones that are just like open but they're tying by the bust area but i wasn't sure like i couldn't find one on sheen that i like so i got this to try um yeah it's just this button v-neck with lettuce edging then i got this white t-shirt with little kitties on it um my review of this is up from far away the kitties look good but up close they're definitely grainy but whatever this will just be cute for a casual day lastly i got a dress i remember black dress that just ties at the bottom so yeah actually i think i'm gonna try everything on right now yeah why the hell not it's definitely cute it definitely fits i'm just thinking that the tie thing looks kind of weird maybe not when it's on the side it needs to be on the side though and i didn't know what the dress has like these cutouts here but the, I, I mean that doesn't that doesn't really change anything but this is the dress i would give it like Probably 7 out of 10. Um, the quality is pretty good. I don't find that it's sheer anywhere. Yeah, and it's soft. The only thing for me is the tie is a little bit weird. But if it's over here, I think it's okay. This, let's just focus on the skirt for now. The skirt is super, super cute. And it does fit well. I was a little bit worried that it was going to be smaller on a bigger body type like mine <sighs> but it fits really well actually um it's a bit short in the back um and it's not see-through at all it has a um a slip here on lining so yeah the skirt i would give it probably 9 out of 10 maybe 10 out of 10. i'll i'll see how the quality is over time but um but don't wear black underwear with it this top on the other hand definitely cute um, it's super cropped, so I have to wear it on a skinny day. I'm sucking in right now, don't be fooled. Um, and it's definitely busty, um, and it is see-through, so I would probably wear this, like, maybe on a beach day, or just, like, lazing around. I don't know, I'll figure out how to style it, but this, I'm gonna give it 5 out of 10. So I'm just wearing bathing suit bottoms for the rest of this, um, haul review thing, because, um, I'm tanning after this and I just don't feel like putting pants on. Let's just have body positivity here, okay? Okay, so I'm wearing this cast shirt now. Um, a little bit see-through, definitely very soft. I don't really know, I just got this because I like cats and it was really cheap. So this is just like casual, casual clothing. I would probably give this six out of 10 only because I wish that the cats weren't so grainy. Like they look blurry. Okay, here's my tie-dye cropped pink shirt. This is definitely really cute. I'm gonna give this like nine out of 10. Soft, not really see-through, um, definitely summery, super, super cute. I really, really like this a lot, actually. Okay, um, I like this. I think it's really cute, but I wish it wasn't so cropped because I can't wear it 
until I tone my tummy. Definitely cute, I like it. I can definitely wear it over a bathing suit or something, um, or with really, really high-waisted jeans. I'm gonna give this seven out of 10. I like this a lot. The quality is, it's not as soft as the rest, but I like that it's kind of oversized on the arms, but not too, too long here. Um, yeah, I don't know, this is cute. I like this for a casual look tucked into shorts or something. And my last shirt, I was really, really looking forward to this. It's not as cute as I imagined it to be, but it's still cute. I wish that the straps were adjustable because it hangs down in my back and I can't cover up my bra strap thing back there, but then if I pull it down, then it's too low in the top. But this will be good for the beach and stuff. So yeah, that's everything. That's my reviews. Um, I would definitely order from Shein again. Quality's not great, but the quality's not terrible. It's not what I was expecting. Okay, I'm gonna go tan, and then Liam and I are going to his grandma's tonight for like a social distance family bonfire. Also, I forgot to say, I'm gonna try and work out more often. I was reading today about Alexis Wren, and apparently her ab and butt workouts are really making improvements in people in like four weeks. So I'm gonna try and do those every day. Um, I'm kind of nervous because I haven't really worked out since high school and I'm 21 now. <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys what my body looks like now and then we'll see if I stick to the workouts for one and two, if I have any improvements week by week. This is my before body. I don't know, it's not terrible, but my tummy definitely needs some toning. So I'm gonna try and do one of the workouts outside right now while I'm tanning. Um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Wish me luck. Man, I got me smoke here to shit. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> 